Hello and welcome. We got one y'all been asking for. <laughs> That's right. This one, Winston Homes delivers. It's one that y'all have been asking for. This is the Kinlock Falls by Winston Homes, or Winston Home Builders, I should say. This is four bedrooms, three bathrooms. And we have lots of this beautiful stonework on the outside. In fact, I don't think Winston Homes knows how to build a home without stonework. I've yet to see one, at least not that I've seen today. And this is about my fourth or fifth one. They all got stonework on the outside and on the inside and just above all, you know, looks really good. <laughs> so as I said, four bedrooms, three bathrooms, great big bedrooms too. And you've got, let's see, the electric fireplace, huge kitchen all down at that end of the home. In fact, the kitchen takes up that whole end of the home back there. <laughs> yeah. And if you like doors over doors and lots of them. This home's going to deliver for you. And you can find this at Regional Homes here in uh, Gulfport, Mississippi, which is just outside of Biloxi. I'm trying not to get too much of this pallet factory in the shot here. Because it's kind of nasty looking over there. But we got uh, no patio door. But we got our back door right there. And now let's... Uh, Head on in. I know y'all are gonna be drooling over this kitchen. As we come up, you can see we've also got the, so we got the vinyl over the top of the stonework. Really nice light fixtures, and now let's head in. What do you think? <laughs> two fans, two like I mean, giant coffered ceiling, all your vents are in the ceiling, tons of lights in the ceiling. Of course, there's no power in this one. Otherwise, I'd give you the full show, but. <laughs> so what can you say? I mean, it is just beautiful. There's your built-in entertainment center. So let's step back over here and just take a look at how big this room is. And I took my shoes off and my feet are still making some squeaking noises on the floor. I'm sorry. So here is our dining area. Nice big dining area. Now one thing I didn't mention is none of your bedrooms are directly off of any of your main living spaces. None of them are off the living room. None of them are off the dining room. None of them are off the kitchen, which clearly takes up the whole end of the home. <laughs> We've got our microwave right here, the white cabinets, and they went with kind of an ash colored cabinet down here in the island. Oh, I take that back. It's white. <laughs> what do I know? I'm just a guy on YouTube that films these homes, right? <laughs> See? 
Now it looks like it's ash again. <laughs> I know. Really nice light fixtures. Love when they go with something different like this over the vent hood. See, I told you, if you like drawers over doors and need a lot of drawers, they got you covered. That is one thing I have noticed about all the Winston homes that I've built, or that I've filmed so far today. That's my first day ever getting a chance to film them. There is a ton of cabinets in their homes. And they're all soft clothes and pull way out past the end of the drawer. And you've got a ton of windows in here. So far, I don't think that any of them open that I've seen so far. Nice farmhouse sink. All right, Whirlpool stainless steel appliances. Are we ready to move on? Or should we still oogle a little more? Okay, I'll go. <laughs> we'll come back over here. That's the special area. So at this end of the home is where you're gonna find the guest bedrooms, the utility room, and your two other bathrooms. Starting with the utility room. Now they went with the big stainless steel farmhouse style sink with the, the uh, sprayer faucet. There's going to be your washer and dryer. And we got to ignore that door. We can't go in that door. That's the special area. <laughs> Water heater access, your furnace. I don't make it sound like it's a bad place, right? <laughs> That's the special area. You got to avoid the special area. We have the square sink. Hello, Raiden. I'm losing it. <laughs> so we have a linen closet in our bathroom. Water closet. True water closet, because you've got the shower tub combo and the toilet in here. And then we will take a left to the back bedroom. Now this one, we're not going to try to walk too much into this bedroom because there's a lot of trim supplies and I don't want to be stepping over something and accidentally break it. Let's see if I can reach around here, show you the closet. And then bedroom number two. We can get the closet first, and then we'll swing around and catch the bedroom. And 
the other bathroom. Now this one does not have a window in it, so it's a little on the dark side. But you still have that great big shower tub combo. So now for the third bedroom. And they all had these kind of stand out corner closets. So at the top of your, or at the front of your hallway is your uh, attic access. And now for that special area. So we come back this way, off of our dining room. We have our another storage closet. And you can even use this as a pantry if you wanted to. Not that you need one with all those cabinets in the kitchen. And then the bedroom. And they've all kind of been, or a lot of these accent walls, have been this like really light baby blue color. And now, what y'all have been waiting for. I told you it was a special area. We got the dual sinks. Of course they went with the square sinks. giant tub big tile shower as so we step up in here we got the wand you got the regular shower Now, of course, you can get lighter colored tile if you want. Looks really, really good. We've got our extra wide water closet. So, and then the bedroom closet. Now this is on the back of the home. Try not to look out that window. That's that pallet factory over there. Of course, wooden racks. We got the bench. And then we got some drawers. Now what could be behind this door? Oh yeah, the utility room. <laughs> I told you, told you this door goes into that special area. But what wouldn't, or what would be really special is if y'all would go down into the comment section and let me know what you think of the Kinlock Falls by Winston Homes. Kind of a farmhouse style, but yet it's not. I really like the changes they've made to it, the things they've done. Let me know in the comments what you think 
And don't forget to hit the like button, hit that subscribe button, turn on the notification bell, share this video with all your friends and your family, you know, all the people you might know, even the ones that, you, that say they know you on Facebook, right? We all have those. <laughs> and uh, I'll be back shortly with some price information. Thanks for watching. Oh, am I? Yes. But you gotta watch your kite. It's up in the air! I'm just letting a little more spring come out. Yeah. So, did y'all enjoy that one? You're I know! It's your turn. And by the way, if you guys are wondering who picked it. And why did you pick it? My dad didn't know which video to make, so I just picked a video. Alright, so anyway, I guess we better get some price information for you. So like I said, this is the Kenlock Falls. Or So this was filmed at Regional Homes in Gulfport, Mississippi. As I stated, this is kind of just outside of Biloxi, kind of all in the same location. So I filmed this kind of just before I went to the Biloxi Home Show. So these were actually the very first Winston homes I ever got filmed. I was really impressed with them. Kind of nice to get something different for a change. And I know you guys have been requesting Winston homes for quite a while. So now we got to get some price information for you. Of course, we don't know, you know which regional dealer you're going to buy this at, but they had this home going for right around $195,000. So super nice home, just under 200,000, 2,200 square foot. And man, that kitchen was just like super nice. If you're uh, enjoying these Winston homes, check out some of the ones that were in the playlist over here from the home shows, or you could check out some of the other super nice homes over here. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.